Hey, what's going on everyone? Appreciate y'all coming here and checking out this Starfield video. I don't know why I just made the introduction like that. But in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all how to get an overpowered armor set literally at the very beginning of the game. Now this is something Bethesda may patch in the future just because of how broken this really is. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. If you find it enjoyable by the way consider taking a little bit of your time sometime during this video and leaving a like on it the support is greatly appreciated so yeah first things first when you're at the lodge which oh almost forgot in case you don't know where the lodge is which most of you probably do if you've ever played starfield this is literally one of the first places you go to in the game it's located on alpha centauri and then you just want to head to jemison and then on jemison yeah, this is one of the first places you go to. Once you complete uh, the quest that leads you to the lodge, you end up becoming level 3. But, yeah, this is insane. Like, I was literally just level 1 a minute ago. I just got a bunch of XP for completing this mission, and it boosted me up. But, yeah. Now let's go ahead and get into this overpowered armor set. I'm also going to be showing you all some great mods to put on this, and I'm just going to be showing it in action too. So if you head into the basement of the lodge, and head over here, and then over here, wait, whoops, wrong way, and then over here, in this room, you will find this spacesuit in the corner here. And as you can see, it requires, unfortunately, a master lock, but there's a glitch to get this unlocked early. You don't have to have the master lock skill to get this open. If you look real closely in the crack here, if you look real closely in the corner of this case here, you can find an opening. Um, failing at the moment. Let me crouch. Maybe that'll help me. Yeah. There it is. I didn't technically have to crouch, as you can see, I just uncrouched, I don't know why I did that. You don't have to crouch, don't think you have to crouch. But yeah, as you can see, now it states mannequin. This means I can interact with the mannequin to get the spacesuits off of it. And check this out, the Mark 1 Complete Armor Set. <laughs> this is crazy! I'm going to be showing you some great mods to put on this too. But yeah. We just got this extremely early. Yeah, that's right. I named my guy Major Mask. Zelda Major's Mask is literally like my all-time favorite game ever created. It's the best Zelda game in my opinion. Speaking of Majora's Mask, I actually named my cat Majora. One of my cats. I got four. I know that kind of stuff you guys don't really care about. Don't know why I'm randomly mentioning this stuff. But uh yeah, as you can see, here's what the full spacesuit looks like. I'm telling you all, this is an extremely great spacesuit to have. Let me go ahead and get into the stats of it. I don't know if you guys saw, but look at uh the physical energy and EM resistance compared to what we start with. 69, 37, 53 for what we start with, right? And then this suit has 120 physical, 136 energy, and 128 electromagnetic. So yeah, definitely a huge difference there. Here is the pack compared to the one we start with. 66 physical, 64 energy, and 68 electromagnetic. And the tunnel mining pack is what we start with. And this has 30 physical, 22 energy, and 26 electromagnetic. And lastly, for the helmet, the helmet has 66 physical, 64 energy, and 68 electromagnetic resistance. And the one we start with has 34 physical, 18 energy, and 26 electromagnetic. Once again, a big difference, even without the modifications. So this is what we're rocking with. Now let me go ahead and head on over to where you can put the mods on this to make it even more powerful. Yeah, so over here we can find the spacesuit workbench. But yeah, when you're on this, you're able to modify the armor set. So, in order to modify, you just click A on one of the pieces, and where it states it has no mod, you just want to click A, and this is where you can add some good mods onto this armor set once you get the requirements. What you want to put on this spacesuit is extra capacity. This will add 10 extra kilograms, so basically it's like this spacesuit is nothing when you put it on, which is convenient. And then in slot 2, you want to add medic. This will make it so 8 items restore additional health and heal more quickly. For the boost pack, that's totally up to you. Power boost pack is going to make you jump higher, 
basic boost pack is you know the basic one etc etc you know you could choose the kind of boost pack you want but I recommend those mods on the pack and then for space helmet and then on the helmet you can put on ballistic EM shielding or energy shielding depending on what you feel like you're going up against the most then here you could put on explosive shielding or sensor array yeah just make sure you're adding mods to this spacesuit too to make it even definitely recommend I think I've recommended getting this multiple times <laughs> in this one video but yeah that should get the point across right <laughs> definitely go and get this it doesn't matter if you're a veteran player and already have like great armor this is still a good armor set to get a hold of I mean it's especially good if you're just starting out too anyways now let's you know test this out against some some people I'm just gonna go out here I'm not gonna save it I just want to show off the damage resistance with this bad boy. All right, here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Ain't got nothing on me. You're scared, aren't you, buddy? You're scared. Yeah, I will be too. You're scared, aren't you, buddy? How is he so powerful at such a low level? Well, you should check out this video and it would show you. But unfortunately, you didn't do that. All right, I'm playing on very easy, so this really wasn't the greatest demonstration. Let me go ahead and boost up my difficulty, though. It's going very hard. But yeah, you see how weak his attacks were? Pathetic, right? It's like I was getting hit by a mosquito. Actually, mosquitoes can be pretty deadly at times. Sometimes they can carry diseases. His attacks don't deserve that kind of status. So it's like I was being hit by, like, a, a fly or something. I'm looking for someone else. Where's all the security at? Aha, there you are. What's up? Oh, wrong person. So sorry. I didn't mean that. Oh, well. This is a good demonstration. I'm on very hard. and Yeah, there's the damage. He's doing a good amount. He's also missing a lot. Come on, buddy. This is embarrassing. Where are you going? I... You know what? I'm gonna heal. We'll start. We'll start over. Oh, we got some others. Why are you guys in the? I'm literally standing still. I'm gonna come to you. How about that? All right. Look at them. Look at them both shooting me. And look how much damage they're doing. I'm level three and they're level twelve. This is pathetic. Freaking noobs. This is pathetic. And I haven't even invested into any skills. Oh, this can't reach that far? Oh, man. Oh, they got me, finally. Sheesh. Bunch of little nooblets. Hopefully that was a good enough demonstration for you all. I'm telling you guys, get this armor set. I guess that's wrapping up this video, though. Hopefully you all found this enjoyable, and you end up actually getting this armor set. Highly recommend it. <laughs> I said that enough. I'm out of here. Until next time, everyone. Peace.